Hey, what's up there, movie freaks? Hanging out with Hero Lair again. Scorching hot day in Toronto. Oh my god. Sweating, <laughs> but we've turned the air conditioner off just to make sure you can hear our lovely voices. Hopefully, <laughs> gasp in excitement. Uh, you might hear me sweat. You yeah. might hear me sweat. I'm, gonna, I'm hearing you sweat right now. <laughs> yeah. Uh, waiting for the watching the Olympics. Just waiting for Disney to drop trailer number two of uh, Rogue One. Here we go. Here it is. Damn. The world is coming undone. Imperial flags rain across the galaxy. Can you be trusted without your shackles? Let's just get this over with, shall we? We have a mission for you. A major weapons test is imminent. We need to know how to destroy it. If you're really doing this, I want to help. Good. Good. I've been recruiting for the rebellion for a long time. You destroyed our home. I fight the Empire now. I fear nothing. All is as the Force wills it. <laughs> Shit. The captain says you are a friend. I will not kill you. Thanks. <laughs> there isn't much time. Every day they grow stronger. Chance of failure. Fucking, oh. fucking droids, man. Well. Never tell me the odds. This is our time. Oh <laughs> my god! Are you with me? Jeez. Wow. All the way. <laughs> right at the end. What a tease. Oh my god. What a tease. All right guys, one more time and now we'll we'll talk through it. I got to watch go I got to go one more time. So I don't know I don't know what's This has probably a new city. The world is coming undone. This looks like a different I, world. I, I read that there's a new planet called uh Jed High. Okay. I love the scale too. Like I used oh, to see yeah. the star destroyer over top. They've nailed the scale. Let's just get this over with, shall we? It's just so reminiscent, like it's so yeah. perfect. Yeah, this Mon Moth, yeah, this Mon Moth Oh, it's amazing. Perfect. We need to know how to destroy it. It's so amazing to see the old ships back. Yeah. I like That's a whoop ship. That is a new ship. I've never seen that before. Yeah. Good. I've been recruiting for the rebellion for a long time. We destroyed our home. The now. Interesting cast of oh, characters yeah. too. That's great lines. Like that whole. Yeah. The captain says you are afraid. Honestly, four senses. Nice. There isn't much time. Every day they grow stronger. Like I wonder if he's like above Tarkin. Or if he's just... Oh, he's like, got to be at least equal. Like, it looks the same. I love all this beach stuff. It's like a World War II film. Exactly. Right in the middle in Star of Wars. Like, Star Wars. And the thing is... Look at that. <laughs> an RPG. Would have. But all this shit, like, this is all within atmosphere. Yeah. Like, we're, we're used to seeing all these ships, like, against black background. You're right. Yeah. We're seeing all this stuff inside. Daylight. Oh, wow. Very cool. That's the one thing I noticed more about this film. Oh, God. <laughs> the Vader. Oh, my God. The Vader. Very but, cool. yeah, like, the, everything here is against daylight. 
and yeah. sand and everything like that. Whether it be the ATAT -AT at the end, which mm -hmm. is not against snow, yeah. or whether it be like the uh, all the the different ships, the X wings and and the Tie fighters, it's all against daylight and yeah. versus like a, a city background or a desert background or yeah. something like that, which is it's such a it's it's completely outside of what we're used to seeing them. I guess oh, like a stark sure, black yeah. background, and, and there's almost like an infantry. Yeah, infantry um, battles. There's some sort of like hover tank going through the streets. Oh my god! Right. Another Very thing cool. too is what's really cool about this, and something just because of lack of, I guess, technology at the time, or or the. Uh, uh, to meld everything is you're seeing actors and the ships together all the time. Like yeah. before you'd see like yeah. in Star Wars, you'd see the ships and then cut away you'd be inside of the ship. Yeah. You're right, yeah. Outside. Here you're seeing everything together. Mm -hmm. Like there's a perfect meld of the two worlds. Yeah, good point. Yeah, yeah. Because in the 70s you couldn't rotoscope the two. No. It would look ridiculous. And then in the prequels, CGI just wasn't there yet. And they were never really on real sets anyway. This is seamless though. Yeah, very this seamless. is absolutely yeah. seamless. And like you said, they have the scale right, but but the fact that you said that just shows that like before they never even would have the scale because it would always be cuts. It'd always be, yeah. okay, outside, yeah, yeah. boom, inside, outside, in, uh, yeah. and now here you're actually getting the, like a, a Star Destroyer in the background of a mountain and someone on yeah. a mountain. That's phenomenal. Yeah, very cool, yeah. It's definitely perfecting of, of the two. Uh, scale looks on point. All these characters, even though I don't really know who they are, know very little just from character briefs. Yeah. Like, I care. Oh, yeah. Already. Like, I want to know who that cool captain looking guy is. Yes. Right? And is he somehow related to a Wedge or somebody? I'm, I'm sure the captain, I think the captain's name was released, and it's a name I, I didn't recognize. Mm -hmm. So, as far as we know, a lot of these guys are kind of newer characters that aren't linking anywhere which is what I, which I like is which is good I, I'm, because I, we don't need you know every black guy to be related to Lando yeah, exactly. we don't need we don't need like you know I think Jen Erso is the uh, that's the character name of um, the lead protagonist yep. the female and then there's fan rumors talking about oh well maybe she's Ray's mother because age wise it would work out with him and Luke don't do that. Yeah. You don't need it to be It doesn't all need to be intercollect. Yeah. Like the whole thing is it's a galaxy. It's huge. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Let there be outside characters. Let's yeah. explore the vastness. Like I'm this. down for that too. Yeah, yeah. I, I, I want to see complete characters outside and I want to explore the universe outside. That was one good thing that, you know, like the like the cartoons used to do. Remember like the, the earlier cartoons when we were kids, like the droids and the Ewoks? Yeah. Even though they were really cheesy, was they would explore the galaxy outside. Mm -hmm. Side of the normal, yeah. you know, Good like uh, yeah. characters. Yeah, it, it wouldn't. It wouldn't make it smaller. It would always. Yeah, make it, it bigger, yeah. and yeah, that's what I want from this. Yeah, agreed, agreed. All right, guys. Well, you can tell we're excited. Oh, I love this. Little um, do you know what's actually good? Because I, I really wanted to see a Vader clip, and we got it. Yeah. Selfish me would have been like, show me him fighting. Yeah. Oh yeah. But it's kind of better if they don't. If they don't show it, all I it'll want pay is off like, so much. Better. It'll pay off so much, and yeah. and you and I are are both like this because we're guys. When it comes down to it, you gotta understand we watch trailers because of you guys, the fans. The two of us, we would never. We would just yeah. like get a little bit of a synopsis and then boom, go to the movie because yeah. too many times they just release so much information in trailers that you get to the movie and it's like, oh, seen yeah. it, seen it, yeah, seen true, it, yeah. and you can predict everything. The fact that they're not doing that here is. I, I, I'm happy for that. It's a yeah. good thing. So it's Matt, definitely, a good it comes thing. out at the end of the year, so there'll be another couple. Yeah. Um, you know, again, we're we're trying to give you reactions for the channel. If we didn't have the channel, yeah, I would do like like for Mad Max, um, The Dark Knight Rises, yeah, all those big kind of movies before we started the channel. I'd literally be in theater, know that trailer was coming up, and do this. <laughs> I'm not watching. I'm not nothing. watching. I saw nothing of Interstellar. I saw yeah. that. You know. So uh, again, we we've had some some movies spoiled because because of the trailer going in because we're doing it for the channel. Yeah. Give us just a little, just little tidbits, and that last bit was. And, uh, and it's like, and there's just so many out there, yeah. South Paul, that just tell you the whole story yeah, in true. the whole trailer. You don't yeah. even have to watch the movie. So. Okay, but yeah, solid, solid first trailer. This marketing campaign's on point. Love it. Disney you got my money. You got my money, Lucas. <laughs> Give it all, all of it. Take my money. And, and whatever that new like U wing looking. Oh, that looks amazing. Rebellion ship. We'll get that in. I, I'll, I'll have a model kit of it yeah. because I'm a geek. <laughs> uh, yeah, leave me alone. I like that yeah. shit. What can I say? 
All right, guys. Uh, give us a like and a comment. You excited for Rogue One? You liking what you see? Uh, also, please don't forget to subscribe. We're inching our way closer to 10,000. Really need your help to do it. Follow us on Twitter at The Hero Lair. We'll hang out with you very, very soon. See ya. See you soon, guys.